year 1170, the Archbishop of Canterbury, Thomas Becket, was murdered. Journey back 800 years and experience it all firsthand. Ah, silly move. Checkmates. I do have some good news for you, though. What is that? Well, since Archbishop Theobald recently passed away, we need someone to fill his spot. Would you be interested? Gladly. Huzzah! Now I have finally have someone on my side. I now pronounce you Archbishop of Canterbury. Huzzah! Huzzah! As time passed, Becket proved his loyalty to the church and resigned his position as Henry's chancellor. Soon, Becket and Henry are you. Clerics can only be charged in church courts. But they won't get the punishment they deserve. I will have them tried in my courts. I refuse to allow that. Henry creates the constitutions of Clarendon to allow him to be able to try clerics in his courts. Outrageous. I'm practically surrendering my church liberties. But I suppose I have to sign it, right? Yeah, okay. Shortly after Becket signs this, he changes his mind without consulting the bishops, disavowing his, his oath. This council is to answer charges placed against Thomas Becket. The charges include contempt of the king's court in a land dispute case and embezzlement of royalty funds. Traitor! Amidst these changes, Becket flees to France and stays there for the next six years. I didn't realize you blows were back yet. King Henry had the Archbishop of York conduct the coronation of his 15-year-old son as co-ruler. This was a direct violation of the rights of Canterbury. He feared the poor would intervene quickly and agreed to make peace with Thomas. Becket returns to England in November 1170. Henry and the Knights stay in France. Missing all my bishops! Will no one rid me of this troublesome priest? Did the king just tell us to kill the archbishop? I do not know. Did he? No, we shouldn't. But we will. But I don't want. Hush you, we shall kill him. The four knights leave for Canterbury. Hello? No, this isn't King Henry the Second. You must have the wrong number. There weren't any foes in the 1100s. Anyway, the four knights leave for Canterbury on December 29th, 1970. They force their way into the cathedral. Fire. Hey, don't blow fire. Fire is fun. Yeah! 